1933's King Kong might look dated when compared to cinematic marvels of today, but it was a shocking technical achievement in its era. Kong, the eighth wonder of the world! As thrilling as it was, it was meant to be a far more brutal film, having an original runtime of 125 minutes that was cut down to just 100 minutes due to pacing issues. That missing 25 minutes is the stuff of legend, and much of it was never recovered off the cutting room floor. The most infamous missing scene is known as the Spider Pit sequence. After a number of sailors fall into a ravine while trying to cross to the other side, we expect that they crashed into the rocks below and died, as the final cut of the movie suggests. But in the original cut, many of the sailors survived the fall, only to be eaten alive by giant spiders, insects, and other creatures. Reportedly, the scene was cut for being too extreme after test audiences screamed and left the theater. But Marion C. Cooper, the co-writer and co-director of the film, wrote in a studio memo that he cut the scene himself because it stopped the story. He was also worried that the scene took the attention away from Kong himself. No trace of this scene has ever been found, aside for some still photographs and pre-production artwork. In 2005, Peter Jackson reimagined the scene for his King Kong remake. He also shot another version for fun that appears on the two-disc DVD of the original King Kong. This version uses the same stop motion and filming techniques used in the original. Aside from the DVD and the remake, the Spider Pit sequence can also be found in the original 1932 novelization and the 1968 comic book adaptation.